what's up guys so let me tell y'all about these rockefeller oysters if you know you know i love rockefeller oysters so this is the finished touch i'm just giving y'all a little preview before we get to the end y'all look at all that cheese look at that spinach like this is about to bust okay there i go there i go hey <laughs> It's time to win, it's time to win cause I don't lie to lie yeah. Be by my side, now bitch switch up, show me your true ride or die yeah. Be my umbrella in the rain, baby girl, you gon' keep me dry yeah. Yeah. Just tell me, baby Alright guys, day two And we about to get some seafood, y'all well, my baby really haven't been letting me eat like crab legs and shrimp and stuff. I just really be wanting oysters. I ate seafood so much before birth. I mean, before being pregnant. So now he just, he don't be feeling seafood. Hey, y'all. We so, are at Island Pacific Seafood Market um, by one of the military bases over here in California. So it's more so like a Filipino uh, market, but they sell a lot of fresh seafood. So we're gonna go in here today and see if they got some oysters, y'all. So Keith is going to make us some oyster Rockefellers. Uh, <laughs> oyster Rockefellers. And I think I'm gonna try to get him to put some on the grill and like- Yeah, some char um, grilled oysters. Yeah, yeah, char oysters. So this, this is it. Now we go in. She's such a YouTuber, y'all. Y'all need to drop her in her comments. She needs to get her channel back. She needs to start vlogging. She got to So this is it. Super cool. What's that though? All right, y'all. We're grabbing the oyster, guys. I'm gonna try to get some good ones. Y'all just don't know how happy I am. Yeah. All right, guys. So you have China and Keith, and this is their YouTube channel below. So Keith is the instructor, and we are the students. He is teaching us how to shuck these oysters. So if you will watch, he's giving us a quick lesson. Um, he's very fluent in what he does. So, pow, he got it open. Period. And he gonna eat it raw. He tried to make me eat it raw, but nah. So right here you have me just cutting up the Romano cheese. This cheese is expensive, but it is so good. And it's highly recommended when you're making Rockefeller oysters at home. Um, you can get it from your local store. All right, so I'm just going to cut, 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 cut. The screen going to move just a little bit fast. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm just cutting the cheese still. Guys, and this is the cheese I use. Romano cheese. Block cheese. Yeah, I got it. And then put it those in the camera. Job. Amazing. My turn. All right, show me you up. Don't break the knife. All right. I got the hardest one. Told it. No, that's not the bad, sister. This the bad. Uh, you see it? Don't play. Make sure when you get it, stick it in there first and make sure it's like stuck in there. Oh, yeah, it was. You about to break that, too. What, too? Push, push, push first, yeah. Okay. 
Make sure, and then you can put the oyster up with it. You know what's in there. Okay. Cause that's all we got now. So I'm gonna break that tip. What's that in your easy? Not to be struggling. <laughs> Get a good cut. Sean cutting it like she cut onions and bell pepper, that ass. Let me see if I can get it in there for you. Okay, so here I go again. I'm going to try it again. Yeah, this is so funny. Okay, Sean, you can do it. You can do it. Y'all cheer me on. Ooh, I am trying my hardest to shut this oyster. All right, she's going to get a, a couple of flicks for TikTok. You know what I'm saying? Like, we just be recording. Recording everywhere you go. Okay, the instructor's sick of me. He ready to get me a zero in the class, so he had to step in to help. And he is, like, sick of it. He like, you ain't learned nothing in class. And look at me laughing. See, I don't take, I'm not taking this class serious. <laughs> the instructor is over it. He telling me you you're not doing it right. You gotta hold you gotta hold the back of it. That's your grip. That's your aim. And I'm still taking it as a joke. Estrada is over it. He's probably gonna fail me. I think I failed this class, y'all. But I finally got my win. Yay! <laughs> it took me a while, y'all, but I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. And that's how you shuck some oysters. So right here, this is the sauce. You're going to use heavy whipping cream, Romano cheese, black pepper, garlic powder, kosher salt, and spinach. And you're going to mix it all together. And y'all, this sauce buzz, buzz, buzz. All right. So it's time to put them in the oven. So you're still going to put the Romano cheese on top. And that's why I showed you that. And that's your mixture that was just on the stove with the ingredients that were listed previously. Okay, and there I am putting the mixture on there. Oh my goodness, y'all. Just look at that creamy spinach. Like, look, just look at that mixture. That mixture by itself was just so amazing. So, now that we're done with that, we're going to add the cheese to all of them. So, you see how you put the cheese on top and you also put the cheese in your mixture. So, put it on top, put it on top, put it on top. Get them oysters right. You know what I'm saying? I was caught by surprise, but yeah, kiss the chef. Y'all know what it is. Time for the oven, baby. Oh, look at them things. Don't they look good already? And this is the final product, Rockefeller oysters. Yeah, we did it, y'all. <laughs>